what is up guys this is AR and welcome back to my channel for today's video we are going to talk about different bank interest rates in my previous video I already shared with everyone what are the different savings account that we should have by the way if you're new to this channel please make sure to subscribe hit the thumbs up button and turn on the notification bell so you will be notified whenever I upload a new video I'm going to share insights on investing personal finance, and also self-development. With that, let's get on to the video. Our first bank is Banco de Oro. For uh, Banco de Oro, they do have um, peso savings accounts, the products listed on their website, passbook savings, ATM savings, they also have optimum savings and junior savers. So they do have here a minimum initial deposit for passbook savings, that's going to be 5,000 and the minimum monthly average daily balance is 10,000 and the minimum balance to earn interest is 10,000 and if you're going to open an account which is passbook savings account um, the gross interest rate per annum is 0 0.125 percent another one is the ATM savings as you can see on the screen um, your gross interest rate um, per annum is 0 0.125. Minimum initial deposit is 2,000 pesos and the minimum monthly average daily balance is 2,000 and for you to be able to earn interest, it should be 5,000 pesos. They also have um, optimum savings and also junior savers but on their website, um, you need to call or visit the preferred BDO branch for the latest interest rates. Next a bank, we have the Metro Bank uh, and Trust Company are mostly um, or most commonly known as Metro Bank. So for Metro Bank, they do have passbook savings and they also have debit ATM card savings. Basically for their uh, Passbook savings account, the initial deposit is 10,000 pesos. Maintaining balance is the same, 10,000 pesos. And for you to earn an interest of 0 0.125, you need to have a 10,000 pesos as well. And of course, withholding tax of 20%. Below minimum min min monthly balance fee for two consecutive months, that's going to have a charge of 300 pesos. For commercial, the in initial deposit is 50,000 pesos. Maintaining balance is 50,000 pesos. Balance to earn interest is 50,000 pesos and the interest rate is 0 0.125. If you go uh, below below the maintaining uh, or minimum ba monthly balance, you, you have a charge of 500 pesos. Uh, for the OFW remittance passbook savings, um, not applicable for the initial and maintaining balance but for you to earn an interest of 0 0.125 you should have a 10,000 pesos they do have fund savers club initial deposit is 100 pesos and the maintaining balance is 500 pesos and for you to earn an interest it should be it should have 4,000 pesos and the interest rate is 0 0.125 Below monthly balance fee, 300 pesos. They also have an SSS pensioner. The initial deposit is 100 pesos. And maintaining balance is the same 100 pesos. For you to earn an interest, you should have at least 10,000 pesos. Interest rate is 0 0.125. They do have passbook savings. Um, U.S. pensioner regular initial deposit is 500 pesos. The same with the maintaining balance, which is 500 pesos. Balance to earn interest is 10,000 pesos. Interest rate is 0 0.125. If you um, go below the maintaining balance, you have a fee of 300 pesos. Now, if, you're, if you don't like um, passbook savings account on Metro Bank, um, they do have debit or ATM card savings account for regular. Uh, the initial deposit is 2,000 pesos. And the maintaining balance is 2,000 pesos. And for you to earn an interest, you should have at least 10,000 pesos. Interest rate is 0 0.125. If you go below the minimum balance, you have a fee of 300 pesos. 
OFW, not applicable for the initial deposit. Maintaining balance, not applicable for you to earn interest of 0.125%. The balance uh, to in earn interest is 10,000 pesos. For SSS pensioner, initial deposit is 100 pesos. Same goes with the maintaining balance. Balance to earn interest is 10,000 pesos. And the interest rate is 0 0.125. Basically, for Metro Bank, as you can see on the screen, all of the interest rate is 0 0.125. That includes for passbook savings together with the debit or ATM card savings. Next bank that we have is Land Bank of the Philippines. This is their uh, website. So for Land Bank, they do have four categories here. They have ATM savings account. They have EC Saving Plus or ESP. They have High Yield Savings Account or HYSA and the Regular Passbook Savings Account. So for the type of deposit account, for Regular Passbook Savings Account, for the minimum um, initial deposit for individual is 10000 Um, For corporation, that's also 10000 Required... Um, balance to earn an interest is 10,000 for both interest rate is 0 0.05 from 0.10 percent for a savings account with ATM access um, the minimum deposit is 500 and the required uh, balance to earn interest is 2,000 pesos the interest rate is 0 0.05 from 0 0.10 percent they do have a US dollar savings account the minimum deposit is $100 and for you to earn or the required uh, daily balance to earn interest is $500. Interest rate 0.05%. Next bank that we have, Bank of the Philippine Islands or BTI. They do have uh, junk start savings. Um, required initial deposit is 100 pesos. The required minimum monthly um Daily balance is 1,000 pesos, required to earn interest 2,000 pesos, and interest rate per annum is 0.125. We do have Maxi Saver, required initial deposit is 50,000, required minimum monthly average daily balance should also be 50,000 for you to earn an interest, but the interest rate is different here. For less than 50,000, not applicable, but 50,000 to 499,999, that's going to be 0 0.125, 500,000 to 999,999 pesos, 0 0.125, 1 million to 4.999, 0 0.125, and 5 million and above, that's going to be 0 0.250. Alright, for passbook. 75,000 is the required initial deposit. Required minimum monthly average daily balance of 75,000 for you to earn an interest. And basically, this is pretty much the same with um, the um, the debit card. It's just a passbook. Now, they do have Padala Manager versus uh, Pamana Padala. For the Padala Manager, uh, required initial deposit, not applicable. Required minimum monthly daily uh, balance that is wave and for you to earn an interest of 0.125% It should have 5,000 pesos for Pamana Padala the required initial deposit is 500 pesos and the required minimum monthly average daily balance that is wave as long as there are four remittances in a year required uh, daily balance to earn interest is 5,000 pesos and the interest rate is the same, 0 0.125. Now, they do have Pamana Savings versus Passbook Savings. For Pamana Savings, required initial deposit is 25000 Required minimum monthly average daily balance is 25000 And for you to earn interest, is the same, 25000 Interest rate is 0 0.125. For Passbook, um, 75000 and the required minimum monthly average daily balance is 75000 And for you to earn an interest, is the same. And the interest rate is 0 0.125. For passbook savings, 
um, there is a difference in here for the required initial deposit is 10,000 required minimum monthly average daily balance is 10,000 for you to earn an interest it's also the same 10,000 that's 0 0.125 per annum for this passbook savings they do have a regular savings versus save up for regular savings the required initial deposit is 3,000 pesos required minimum and monthly average daily balance is 3,000 pesos and for you to earn an interest of 0.125 percent the average uh, daily balance is 3,000 pesos for save up or automatic savings plus insurance required initial deposit not applicable required monthly average daily balance of 1,000 pesos and for you to earn 5,000 pesos interest rate per annum 0.125 percent next bank we have Philippine National Bank or PNB for PNB they do have a savings account um, debit savings passbook savings TAP MasterCard top saver my first savings pensioner savings direct deposit pensioner if you look at the different interest rates um, 0.100% uh, the only difference in here if you choose say for example debit savings that's for a debit card the initial deposit is only 3,000 pesos if you choose passbooks, uh, it's going to be 10,000. Top saver, the initial deposit is 30,000. Uh, my first savings, that's zero. No uh, initial deposit. Pensioner, 100 pesos. Same goes with the direct deposit pensioner. Next uh, bank, we have China Bank. This is their website. So if you go to their website and look at the savings account, the initial deposit requirement is 2,000 pesos. Minimum monthly average daily balance requirement is 2,000. And for you to earn an interest, you should have 10,000. However, the interest rate is the same, 0.125% per annum, subject to 20% withholding tax. Next bank, we have Security Bank. So for a security bank, um, they do have, let's go ahead and try to compare savings and checking accounts. For all access, opening balance is 5,000 pesos. Same goes with easy access, 5,000 pesos. Maintaining balance is 25,000 for all access. For easy, that's going to be 5,000. But um, this coming May 5, 2021, um, it's going to be um, 10,000 already. For the interest rate, 0.10%. Um, Next bank that we have, RCBC or the Rizal Commercial Bank Corporation. For RCBC, one account depends on plan type. That's the minimum initial deposit interest rate, 0.15 to 1%. Required average daily balance, it depends on the plan type. But for you to earn an interest, you should have at least 25,000 pesos. For flexi savers, it's the same. Depends on the plan type for the minimum initial deposit. For the interest rate, it depends on the plan type. For you to earn um, an interest, you should have at least 25,000 pesos. So this is the breakdown. One account interest rates. So for 10,000 to 24,999.99, no withdrawal. Um, so that's no interest rate basically because you need to have at least 25,000 and above. So it's actually feared here for RCBC 25,000 to 49,999.99, your interest rate is 0 0.275. That's up to 499,999. And then half million to 999,999.99, it's going to be 0.4%. If you don't have uh, any withdrawal, if you have one withdrawal, 0.375%. More than one withdrawal, 0.225%. If you have a savings through RCBC, 1 million to 2. 
at least 2.499. Um, that's going to be no withdrawal, 0.4%, one withdrawal, 0.375%, more than one withdrawal, 0.25%. For 5 million to 9 million and above, 0.550% for no withdrawal, one withdrawal, 0.5%, two withdrawal, 0.275%. And for 10 million and up, that's going to be 1000% if you don't have any withdrawal. And if one withdrawal 0.550 percent more than one withdrawal 0.300 percent next bank we also have union bank of the philippines so for the union bank of the philippines they do have a regular savings account for the regular savings account for union bank interest rate is 0.10 percent initial deposit is ten thousand for you to earn interest, you should have 25,000 pesos. Now we have uh, an Iswest Bank. For Iswest Bank, deposit peso savings, minimum initial deposit is 5,000 pesos. Maintaining balance is 5,000 pesos. Interest rate to earn balance is 25,000 pesos. And the uh, interest rate per annum is 0 0.125 per percent and withholding tax of 20 percent there you have it that is actually the last uh, bank um, let's just end here um, this video with a quote if you cannot pay cash it means that you cannot afford it so basically basically if you want to buy something if you cannot pay for um, you know the entire cash or the entire amount you cannot afford it so we have covered uh, different bank interest rates for today's video. I hope that you uh, have learned um, on the different interest rates of the bank that we have right now. And if you did, please make sure to subscribe, hit the thumbs up button, and turn on the notification bell so you get notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe and God bless. I will see you on our next video.